thanks for joining us here at Eclipse Magazine. Thanks for having me. Yeah, thank you. So you are the new kid on the block, the latest character, AJ. Can you tell us a little bit about it? About AJ or about the block? About the block? Oh, sure, the block too. <laughs> uh, it, it's rough out there. But uh, AJ is um, hes a runaway foster kid. He's uh, homeless when we uh, meet him. And um, he just, he's just looking for a home and a family and love. That's all he wants. Okay. He wants to be with his brother. He wants family. He wants love. Now, how did you get involved in this project? I auditioned. Mm -hmm. uh, I think it was three auditions. And um, I remember getting the phone call that I got it. And I was having a rough day. And so it just made my whole, it just made my life. <laughs> It made my life. It was the first time I've ever received a call for a project of this caliber, and so I was real, real excited. Now, how was it um, be, uh, meeting the rest of the characters or the cast members? Was it instant bonding when you all got together? Instant bonding? I'd say that I had a natural connection with um, mm -hmm. David um, mm -hmm. right off the bat. and then. But everyone else, it's just been nothing but support and openness. So, I just happened to sit next to David on the first table read, but everyone, it's pretty much been instant, yeah. Instant love, instant, hi, okay, let's go do this thing that we love to do. Uh, AJ is a complex character. Do you draw from your own life experiences as you uh, portray this character on the show? Um, emotionally, sometimes, but in terms of his life, um, it's very different than the life that I had. Um, but I understand it somehow. A lot of my friends had similar situations growing up and I've just always gravitated towards it. So even though I was very different from it, it, um, it wasn't hard for me to connect the two. Now how do you expect the dynamics to be between AJ and um, Mike's son oh. on this season? Oh man, you know, the two oldest boys, Anything can happen in that situation, you know, there may be some tension, some headbutting. Um, there could be some bonding, there could be some communal aspects, you know, created. But um, I think boys will be boys, <laughs> and uh, these are two boys that have a lot going on. Um, so I think they'll be good together. Now what is the best aspect of playing this character? The best aspect of playing this character is the fact that I understand that I actually have a job speaking for a lot of young men and women that don't have um, the same opportunity. You know, this is a story that is rampant amongst the country, amongst the world, and the fact that I have this ability to tell it is uh, it's very inspiring for me. So you basically, you're a voice to tell other people's stories. In this case, yes, in this case, because this is not my own story. But we know this story is alive and well, um, so yes. Do you have any other last words for fans of the show? Um, just keep watching the show. It's going to be an exciting season. Um, thank you guys for watching. Thanks for all the love and support. And I love y'all and just be true to who you are. All right, thank you so much. Thank you very much.